everybody welcome back to my channel you probably like hey i done seen the shirt yes honey because i have a couple of videos i had to push out and get ready and and it's just a lot so really really quick i, I want to show you guys my october budget at a glance so this is the beginning of the month this is what my expectations are for the month of october these are the things that i'm planning on taking care of for the month of october and so forth you will see a copy of that here so I'm definitely going to post it here. But I'm just going to do a rundown and a breakdown with you guys. So I have it on my phone right here. I use the Kavana app to do this. And I also have it written down right here. I have a printout of it right here. So um, October's budget at a glance. The total income this month is going to be a lot. Is it going to be $1,000 less than it was last month. And it's going to be $3,294 expense extra expected income um because the child support is starting to get a little consistent not much but a little um i'm expecting it to be 240 dollars total bills and expenses should be 2676 dollars um rent 799 first choice power 217 dog insurance 48 cricket cricket went up 20 more dollars because i added my son to the plan so where it was 121 is now 141 um and I, I put the one as a round off. Um, Wig Slayers is a group that I'm in that I will not be unsubscribing from anytime soon. So that stays in the budget. It's $7. Xfinity is $2.25. Um, Centerpoint is $38. Audrey and Lorenz Allowance is $25 each. Kavana is $13. The stocks. I will be adding $25 to my Roth IRA just out of my paycheck. It'll be $25 every two weeks. Um, and if I can add more, I will definitely add more. Um, car insurance, two thirty-eight. Keys, car note, four twenty. Reflex, thirty-five. Legacy, thirty-five. First savings. When you see CC, those are credit cards. Fifty dollars. Coles, forty-seven. Forever, twenty-one. Thirty-three. Firestone, fifty-five. YouTube, seven. Netflix, sixteen. Uh, my ties. The minimum is fifty dollars, but we, of course, according to our according to our income, we definitely add more. <coughs> Sapphire credit card one twenty eight. Um, my to do list is Little Red's B Day gift, which is his PlayStation Four. Um, I plan to get my nails and my feet done. I plan to get my car detailed. Um, my goals my are to save four hundred dollars. No eating out for two weeks straight. No eating out. Period. Um, in two weeks of no buys, I, 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 I feel like I can do two weeks of no buys. Cash envelopes. We're going to stuff nothing in retirement. The kids will steady get their allowance of $25 each. And you're probably like, why do they only get $25 each? Because I do that. I pay for their haircuts. I pay for their hair. <coughs> I pay for their feet. I pay for their clothes. That money is what they want to do extra for themselves. Um, the fur baby, he gets $20. The emergency fund this month is getting $260. And I didn't put anything in retirement this month because I put over $700 in it last month. I want to work on my rainy day slash um, emergency fund this month. Um, each month I take a fund to contribute to and I put a nice little amount away in it. Um, like next month is November so that will be me paying a credit card off. I won't be putting anything in my retirement. I won't be putting anything in my personal savings. I won't be putting anything in my rainy day fund. It'll be me paying a credit card off period. Um, kids care. I get $50 allowance. Um, the kids savings they do get $25 each and it totals up to four or five. My major money goal this month is four hundred dollars and although that's my regular goal that's going to also be my major money goal because although i'm only putting 260 dollars in my rainy day slash emergency fund if i can add extra to my other accounts if i can whether it's 30 dollars whether it's 20 dollars i will do that so that's where that major money goal comes in um so yeah that is my budget at a glance for october i pray that i do really good so, also for the month of October, I'm doing something totally, totally different with the fives and ones challenge. <sighs> yeah, I have drunk something with acid and it's messing with my chest. But um, I'm doing something totally different with the fives and ones challenge this month. So this month I will actually, for the month of October, <coughs> I will actually be saving, hold on. Hold on. 
I will actually be saving all my one dollar bills. Next month, I'll save all my five dollar bills. Um, but I find it better to do it this way just because that's how I want to do it. But yeah, for the month of October, I'll be saving strictly ones, and then oh, in November, I'll be saving strictly fives. So yeah, y'all. And oh, right now, to date, for our fives and ones challenge, I'm gonna take you to my to where I had the money saved so right now I have in my fives I have $61.60 and in my one challenge I have $101.53 and then y'all know I keep my change jar so at the end of the year, I'll be taking that change door, cashing it in, and however they break that money down in fives and ones, that's where I'm gonna put it. Um, yeah, I am becoming a big girl because I had a choice to go to my favorite restaurant today was a lounge spot, and I did not go because I knew it was gonna mean I had to spend money and I didn't want to spend this. I want to spend a day just in my house, taking care of business in my house that needed to be taken care of, get these videos out for you guys, and not spend no money. So I decided to stay in my house and be productive and do the things that I need to do around here. So yeah, I feel really good about that. So I'm going to get out of here. Remember to think smart and spend smarter and plan accordingly. I am Key. This is Key's Plan Life and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Budget for February, our goals for February. Um, what I plan on doing different for February. So this is our February... Um,